Hey, bros, my folks, the hell's going down? Stony back here today, back on the server Age of Wyverns, which is my uh, Nitrado server. It's a 24 7 Nitrado PvE here on Ragnarok. If you guys want to join, uh, search Age of Wyverns in the unofficial PC sessions list here on Xbox One. Now, you guys can also join on Windows 10 if you have the Windows 10 version of Arc, uh, not the Steam version. But uh, it is cross-platform as far as Windows 10 and Xbox goes. So, uh, without any further ado, I would like to show you guys today how to paint dinosaurs. And I'm not talking about with a paintbrush. Although, I guess I can show you guys that too because you can do custom paint jobs like that. But uh, the main thing I want to show you guys today is how to like admin paint the different regions. So, I'm here at Mad Dog's base here uh, next to the Desert Stronghold. He has a wonderful emporium of dinos here. It is just awesome the amount of dinos he has in this little area. Uh, I know he he's definitely proud of the amount of wolves he has. And I think it's just crazy how many wolves he has. But uh, I, I guess they don't call him Mad Dog for nothing, right? So anyway, dudes, I've spawned in a handful of dinosaurs to show you guys. We're going to be painting today an RG, a Rex. A little bitty raptor, a rock drake, a beaver, and a spino. Anyway, so this guy's asking if I'm on, or if I'm ever on. Uh, so anyway, so let's start with the RG. So let's see, it's pretty easy. Uh, you're going to want to make sure you have admin commands. Um, you don't have to put cheat if you're in your own single player server. But if you are an admin in someone else's server, you're going to want to do cheat, blah, blah, blah. So start off with cheat, space, set, target, dino, color, space, zero, space, uh, let's do one. Now let me explain these numbers to you. The zero here is a region of the dino. There are six regions, zero, one, two, three, four, and five. I'm going to start with zero. And then one here is the color code. So there are, I want to say about 42 color codes, somewhere around there. So there are a lot of different colors here, dudes. And um, we're going to go through each one so you guys know what's what. Uh, I'm only going to go through each one once. I'm not going to go through each one on each each dino um, but I will try to actually okay so there's 41 colors so anyway we're gonna skim through these there's quite a few of them so this will just take a minute um, I'm gonna make sure uh, I know color one is a bright red so let's do that and make sure the region even shows up okay so yeah here's the region uh, some dinos don't actually have six regions some of the regions on some of the dinos are blanked out they're nothing so uh, I just wanted to make sure zero was a region on the RG. So here you can see, well, I don't know, it's kind of weird because it's on uh, you know, feathers. So let's do it on a smooth skin so you get a better idea of what we're working with. So we've got a red, one is red. The color code two is blue. Color code for three is green. Color code for four is yellow, five is cyan, six is magenta, a nice purple, seven is light green, eight is light gray, nine is light brown, ten is light orange, 11 is light yellow, 12 is light red, 13 is dark gray, 14 is black, 15, what is 15? 15 is brown, so it's not too much of a difference here. 
Uh, 16 is dark green. 17 is uh, dark red. 18 is white. Now keep in mind, this isn't the whitest white we can do. Uh, later on, I think it's 36, is actually an albino white, which is even whiter. So let's compare this with the albino white now. See, it gets a little bit wider. Anyway, back to, uh, what, 19 is dino light red. 20 is dino dark red. 21 is dino light orange. 22 is dino dark orange. Then we've got 23, dino light yellow. 24 is dino dark yellow. 25, dino light green. 26, dino medium green. 27, dino dark green. 28, Dino light blue. 29 is dino dark blue. 30 is dino light purple. Oh, whoops. 30, dino light purple. 31 is dino dark purple. 32, dino light brown. 33, Dino Medium Brown, and 34 is Dino Dark Brown, 35 is Dino Darker Gray, so Dino Darker Gray is 35, 36 is Dino Albino like I showed you a while ago, that's the whitest shade of uh, white that you can get. We're almost done. 37 is Bigfoot Zero. 38 is Bigfoot Four. 39 is Bigfoot Five. 40 is Wolf Fur. Now, uh, some of these colors are hard to tell the difference on this Rex because it is nighttime out here. So I do, uh, I want to push you guys to actually try this yourself on uh, your own dinos in the light. Actually, let me get Mad Dog to bring his bulb dog out here. Mad Dog, can you bring your bulb dog out to light the area? Please. So, um, the one we just did was wolf fur. Now, wolf fur is cool because it's, uh, I don't know, it's like a different kind of gray. It's like a unique kind of gray. I don't know how to explain it. Uh, I would just, like I said, I, I want to push you guys to uh, experiment with these colors yourself in the, in the uh, you know, on your own dinos. I don't think he got the message. Mad Dog. Can you bring Bulb Dog out here? Alright, so there's one more color. It's Dark Wolf Fur. It's 41. Okay, there we go. I think he's getting his Bulb Dog. So we went through all the colors. Whoa, what is his basilisk? Oh, he's riding his basilisk instead of bringing his bulb dog. All right, I don't think he got the memo after all. Let me just um, spawn in a bulb dog real quick. So let's just do a random level tamed, summon, tamed, uh, lantern, pug, character, EPC. Oh, I'll put Lantern Nug. <laughs> lantern Ug. Alright, this way we can have a little bit of light. Uh, auto activate. Oh, it has to charge first. Okay, so he did bring his bulb dog. 
and we've got light. All right, we've got a little bit of light now. So that's the dino dark, uh, or that's the dark wolf fur. Anyway, now we're gonna go through some of the regions. I did uh, region zero on the RG uh, red, which was this whole main part here. Now I wanna do cheat, set, target, dino, color, uh, one. I wanna do, let's do one blue. So we can see that it doesn't actually have a region one anywhere since it didn't change anything. So let's do region two blue. Okay, so uh, region two on an RG is the tips. We'll do region uh, three. Let's see, let's do region three uh, dino albino. Make an American eagle right now. Uh, maybe it doesn't have a three. I don't know. Let's change it to green. Let's do region three green. Okay, so region three is going to be the feet on an RNG. I'm going to do region four yellow, which is going to be four, four. So it doesn't seem to have a region four. Actually, I think region four is, yep, region four is the headpiece right here. The little bit of uh, feathers right above the head, right on the head here. So let's do region five uh, scion. So region five is going to be most of the body fur. So there we have the different regions of an already. Oh, so region five is also the tail feathers and the midsection of the wings. So if we want to have an American Eagle, we would do uh, region five dino albino. And it's kind of a red, white, and blue. <laughs> with green feet and a yellow head, but you can change that if you wanted to. Anyway, so let's keep going to the Rex. Let's do uh, region zero. Let's do uh, all albino Rex. So region zero, region one, region two, region three, four, and five. I think five is the underbelly. Yep. There we have an albino rex. If you guys ever wanted to have an albino rex, there you go. Now the rock drake. The rock drake is really cool. Because, well, actually, I guess we'll do the raptor first. But the rock drake is really unique because of the feathers, the tips on the feathers. No matter what color uh, you color them, they're still going to have that fluorescent type of uh, like vibe to it. It'll be a different color according to whatever you type, you know, but... It'll still have uh, that, I don't know, like, rainbow-like effect almost. I don't know, you'll see. So uh, let's just do the raptor real quick. Um, let's try region zero. Let's just make, uh, a, I don't know, an all-red raptor. Hopefully by now you guys are comfortable using the command and know how to do it. I think I've demonstrated it enough. So I'm just going to skim through some of these. That's an all red raptor, so um, yeah, that is how to do. Let's do one more, and then I'm going to show you guys how to custom paint the other dinos with a paintbrush. So let's do something cool with a rock drake here. Let's start off by doing region zero. I always work from zero and go up. Okay, so region zero on a rock drake is most of the body skin. Let's do region one, uh, blue, I guess. So region one is the back fur, the tail feathers, the side feathers, and the whole wing feathers. That's pretty cool. All right, let's do region two, um, dino albino. I mean, yeah, region two. So it doesn't look like a rock drake actually has a region two, so let's do region three dino albino. See if that worked. Okay, I wanna say region three was the tips of the feathers. So let's do that again in uh, magenta, see if it works. Oh yeah, oh yeah. See, that is really cool. If you do these different colors, they still seem to have that fluorescent type of 
rainbow effect, see? And uh, in different colors, so I think that's freaking awesome. That magenta with that blue is just amazing. So there you have it, that's the Rock Drake. Now to custom paint other dinos with uh, custom paint jobs, aside from using admin commands. Let's see. We're gonna have to do a few commands, so it's uh, we're gonna wanna do cheat space give colors space uh, let's do 20 now this gives you 20 of each color in the game you can type in whatever number you want there to get that many of each color and then we're going to want to spawn in a paintbrush you can do this with an admin command or you can do uh, this in creative mode with cheat space gcm uh, we're just going to spawn in the paintbrush so it's cheat space gfi space paint brush space one space zero space zero and I have a paintbrush which I already had in my inventory that I didn't see so but at least I'll show you guys how to do it now uh, smack whatever dino you're wanting to paint with the right trigger and then make sure you have whatever color you selected so if I want to do purple I'm gonna Click on the purple and then click on the brush to equip it onto the brush. So we're going to go over to the big image of the Spino, press on it, uh, A if you're on Xbox, X I'm guessing if you're on uh, PlayStation. I've never played Ark on PlayStation. So here you can zoom, it has the controls all right there in the uh, left top hand corner and the left bottom hand corner. So if you want to make a big cursor you can click in the left joystick and you can start painting here and you can do squiggly lines see I'm painting um, you can do smaller lines by clicking in the left joystick again uh, you can zoom in you can rotate you can do all kinds of stuff here you can paint the toenails if you wanted to uh, <laughs> so, and then once you're done with that you, all you do is back out and it's painted see I have painted toenails now and this whole side has squiggly lines all over it so uh, yeah I'm not gonna get too in-depth on how to paint I mean, I pretty much showed you guys just now how to do that. So, um, and you can even do that on top of the other other dinos that you admin painted. So, <clears throat> if you guys uh, want to join the server, like I said, search for Age of Wyverns in the unofficial PC sessions list. If you guys want to know anything about the server, go to www.ageofwyverns.com, and uh, you can check out everything there is to know about the server there. Hopefully, you got something out of this video, guys. Stay tuned for more admin command videos as well as God of War Let's Plays and Walkthroughs. So I'll catch you guys on the flip flop.